Hi there, Jamie from Fit with Flair here to show you how to create a registration form inside Gravity Forms. So first thing you do is create a new form and you're going to end up with this box here. You click on that and nicely it expands for you. So I'm going to call this registration and give it a more descriptive description, which is register for my awesome eight week program, right? That's what we want them to do. Next, we're going to go over to advanced and say, instead of a default submit button, we want register now. And then we're going to go over to here and go down here, schedule form. Okay. Say your program's uh, registration window is from the 20th of June through the 30th of June. And you've gone ahead and said, okay, this is when people can register. And you can then say, sorry, my registration is closed. Please come back on July 20th to register for the next session. If I could type, that would make it a whole lot easier, wouldn't it? Um, so that is that. And then I come over here to the confirmation button and I can tell them what I want to do. So I can either just put text right in place, send them to a different page, or redirect them to a new website altogether. And in this case, I'm gonna say thank you for registering. We look forward to getting you in shape for summer, okay? Something like that. Anyway, that's the not as exciting part of this whole thing. So then you close that. You want somebody to put in all their information. You want them to put in their name, their address, their email address, their phone number. Whoa, I just put all of that stuff in without having to think a whole lot. Maybe you want to personalize it. Your name, maybe you don't want a first name, last name spot. You want single. So it's just the name. You want to make that required. It puts that little star there. Address, okay, I'm in Washington State, so I want to go ahead, hide address line two, want to make it US only. And my default state is going to be Washington. And also want the address to be required. So those are the pretty basic, you know, basic contact form. Now is the cool part, okay? I'm gonna go here and put a section break in because I am done with the information part. Now I wanna get to the real nitty gritty. I wanna say, tell me about your fitness level. Okay, again, I cannot type today. I am so sorry. Okay, tell me about your fitness level. And at this point, we're going to put in things that are not quite the same. We're going to go ahead and put in a checkbox um, and a drop down box. And in this checkbox, I want to know uh, male, female. All right, I guess I'll put gender. I'll make my first choice male, second choice female and get rid of the third option. Now they all have to tell me because I've clicked the required button if they're male or female. Next one here, let's say, how old are you? And you can go 18 to 25, 26 to 34, 35 to 44, and we can say 45 plus. It's that easy, okay? There are a lot of other things you can add, including um, pricing, which I mentioned in the blog post um, on fitwithflare.com. So I want to go ahead and add my product. Okay, my product, my product name is A Week Awesome Program, right? And my, progr my program, has uh, multiple choice. So there's different options that they could be. The first choice is me alone, and that has a price of $2.99. Me and my child is gonna have a price of $3.49. Maybe the child has, you know, something like that. Um, child only, maybe we'll make that one $99. There you go. And then what you've done, close that, and you add a total button. It tells you how much it is. Save the form. It's gonna send that over to 
PayPal. You want to preview the form. This is not formatted quite the way that it normally would be, but you can definitely get an idea of what your form is going to look like. Very simple. See, when I click on that, it changes the price to $349. Really, really cool. Really, really easy to do. Again, this is Jamie from Fit with Flair showing you how easy Gravity Forms is to use for registration on your website. Thank you.